Jersey Sports Zone Shore Conference football coverage is being brought to you by RWJ Barnabas Health. The St. John Vianney Lancers are back on the field for the first time since quarterback Aaron Van Tree suffered a severe spinal cord injury. SJV no doubt playing with heavy hearts. The Lancers take on Marlboro, a Sunday morning kickoff at Howell High School. The Mustangs lost their quarterback, A.J. Schwartz, to a serious leg injury last week. Both teams came to play on a windy and rainy day. Matt Cassidy's having a big year for the Mustangs. Here's a great first down run to the 26 yard line. It would lead to this. Cassidy from two yards out, he's in the zone. Marlboro with a seven nothing lead at the end of one. St. John Vianney takes advantage of a short field. It's Michael Foley on the QB keep. That's a five yard touchdown run. At the half, we've got a seven seven ball game. Third quarter. Marlboro continues to turn to Cassidy to churn out the yards. Matt Cassidy with a first down run to the St. John Vianney 46. But the Mustangs are forced to punt into the wind and this ball starts going backwards. Kyle Ferry is streaking down the sideline. He picks it up and he's gone. Awesome football IQ by Kyle Verius. That's a 37 yard punt return and the Lancers take a 14-7 lead. St. John Vianney had the momentum. Jack Farah cashing in from a yard out. Just 15 seconds to go in the third. The Lancers open up a 20 to seven lead. On the ensuing kickoff, Ryan Mendez has issues with the wet ball, but how's this for a recovery? Mendez breaks a couple of tackles and he's off to the races. There he goes. Ryan Mendez, 95 yards on the kickoff return. That was the final play of the third. So we head to the fourth and Marlboro's right back in it. It's 20 to 14. SJV with a fourth down at the 27. The Lancers are going for it and Foley goes up top. Kyle Varius comes down with it. Ooh, that's big time. In tough conditions, a gutsy play call and a tremendous catch. Kyle Varius with his second touchdown of the game. The Lancers go for two and Foley comes through again. Michael Foley played inspired, replacing Aaron Van Trees at QB as the SJV lead increases to 28 to 14. Marlboro in desperation mode, trying the halfback option and Cassidy throws it high. Furious comes down with the interception and that seals an emotional win for the St. John Vianney Lancers. SJV immediately went to the stands after the clock struck zero to present the game ball to the family of Aaron Van Trees. His cousin, aunt and uncle were moved by the gesture as everyone continues to have Aaron Van Trees in their thoughts and prayers. 28 to 14 is your final. The Lancers have now won five straight games. SJV is most appreciative of the outpouring of support for Van Trees, both through messages and a GoFundMe that has raised over $100,000. It was a long week for St. John Vianney, but first year head coach Jeff Papson's team responded with an inspirational effort. It is hard. Um, I'm getting choked up now because of how well they played. And uh, he's he's just a good kid. And me and Coach Mike, we went to go visit him on Monday after our mass. He was just making sure that we were okay before he was even okay because he sees us getting choked up going to go see him. We love Robin, you, Aaron. We love you, Aaron. We love you, Aaron. Keep fighting, bro. We love you. All for you, A-team. Reporting from Howell High School, I'm Rich Crampanis for Jersey Sports Zone dot com.